this session, I'd like to give you eight things that you can say to newcomers, to, to, to guests or people that you're welcoming at the door. A lot of people say to me, Pastor, I just don't know what to say to people because I don't know who's new and who's not and, and I forget names and all this. So um, this part of this segment is for you. If that's you, um, you're going to love this. So I'm going to tell you exactly what to say. And uh, by the way, this is there's notes that are going to be included with this and uh, all of this will be typed out in, in the notes. So. The first thing that you can say is, is this. It doesn't matter, by the way, if they're a newcomer or if they're a regular or if you know who they are or not. It doesn't matter. You should be able to say this to any person that comes to Minear Christian Church. Good morning. Welcome to MCC. Thank you for coming, and I am glad you are here today. Again, that's, that's just a generic statement that you could say to anybody. That, that comes to our church. Here's something else. You could say, can I show you where you need to go? Now, if they already know, they're going to say, no, thank you. Thank you for asking. Um, but if they don't, that's a very helpful question. And, and, and when, you, when they say whatever they say, um, I don't want you to point. I want you to take them there. Again, to personally escort people where they need to go. A third thing is, um, let me help you with that. If you see somebody coming in the door and they're carrying a diaper bag and kids and purses and bags and umbrella or whatever they got, and it looks like they're having a hard time getting in the door and everything, an easy thing to say is, can I help you with that? Even if they don't want any help, just the idea that somebody would offer, that somebody noticed is a, is a big deal. It's communicating worth and value to that person that they're seeing and they're cared, cared about. Um, a fourth thing, this is, this is my favorite thing to say to people. Please take my seat. If you're in church and you're seeing some new people walk in the back and they're wandering around the sanctuary kind of looking for a seat, it would just tickle my heart as a pastor to hear somebody get up and literally say, here, take my seat. That is awesome. You know, we, I grew up in a church where some people would never give up their seat. And if somebody sat in their seat, they might even say, hey, excuse me, you're in my seat. But by doing that, you're communicating to that person that uh, they don't matter. And, uh, and so we don't wanna do that. I wanna hear people say, here's my seat. Here's another thing you could say. Here's my email address. Please let me know if I can help you in any way. Uh, now, you, I wouldn't recommend saying that to every guest, but Sometimes it's appropriate after you, you talk to them for a little bit. I don't, I don't mind you exchanging contact information just to stay in touch with them. Um, another thing you could say is, let me introduce you to the pastor or the, uh, the life group leader or the welcome center attendant or the worship leader or the kids check-in counter person, whatever that is. Another thing you could say, and this is, this is again one of my favorite things to say to, to newcomers is, would you like to have lunch with me um, today or next week if it doesn't work work out today? Would you like to have lunch? Um, I have found if they do go out to lunch with you, they're you know, more likely to come back the next Sunday or the Sunday after because of, of you taking the time to take them out to lunch. Um, so I strongly encourage um, you inviting people to, to go have lunch with you. Now, some of you say, um, I don't know what to, 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 to tell people when I hand them the guest gift mug. Well, this is, this is what I want you to say. I want you to say something along the lines of this. I hope today's church service has blessed you. And if it has, could you please give us some information so that we can send you a short survey so we could learn from your experience so we could better help people and guests, newcomers in the future um, have a better experience and so that we could best serve you better. And in return, we have this really nice blue tumbler or guest gift for you. Inside of it's all sorts of helpful information, including coupons to Carl's ice cream. And we just want you to know that we really appreciate you coming. And then when you say that, hand them the tumbler, hand them the card and the pen, and most of the time, they're going to fill it out. That's it for our greeter training video uh, from the street to the sea. Hopefully you found this to be helpful this morning. And I just want you to know from uh, your pastor that um, I really uh, appreciate all the uh, work that, that you put into uh, greeting people here at MCC. I do believe that loving people is 
uh, probably the, the, the number one thing we can do to, to grow our church because um, 50 some times in the New Testament, Jesus commanded us to love one another. And he said, by the way we love one another, the world will know that we're Christians. And I, I would take that even further. By the way we love people, they'll know that God loves them too. So thank you for being a part of this process. Um, if you have any questions, give me a call anytime. Um, let's continue to welcome people to the family of God.